Here is the uh, Java EEO web application. It is an uh, auction site, online auction. It's again, you can find the uh, auction item, then doing bidding, or you can sell an item. You log in. Then you can create uh, an auction item, or you can check uh, my auctions which is display the auction items you put on our site or you can check uh, whether you have a bit so you search it and you can uh, bit so now your bit is submitted successfully so you can see uh, your bit or your item on the auction site. We use the WebLogic server. Let's log in to the WebLogic configured application. We can see the auction has been deployed on the WebLogic server. From the uh, Eclipse development ID, you can see the uh, project it is a marvin project it's a marvin project description the plugin we have the marvin plugins and also web logic of marvin plugin so we are going to undeploy the application from the web logic server So it's uh, undeployed. Let's check uh, the uh, WebLogic server. Let's do a refresh. So the web application has been undeployed. So now we don't have the uh, website available. Now from the uh, Eclipse, we are going to use the uh, Marvin plug in. First, we do a Marvin clean. So it is successful. Now we do a Marvin package. So successful Marvin build. So we do a deploy. It will give it in the web logic of Marvin plugin. Deploy. successful. Now we look at the uh, web logic server. We do a refresh, check the application. Now we can see the auction site or the web application has been deployed on the uh, web logic server. Now we do Refresh. Website is uh, available right now. Now we do a uh, run as build and do undeploy 
from the web project is server. Successful. Now we, the website is no longer available. Let's do a refresh. See, the website is no longer deployed on the web logic server. So we also from the uh, Eclipse to uh, Marvin e store life cycle Done. It's a successful. Now look, look at the Hassan continuous integration server, which is uh, being deployed on the WebLogic server. First, we check at the uh, subvision. SVN status. So there's no any modification to the overall project. We do a VI a project file. Here we press the delete. We do a add test. So we save the file. We do a it tell us it has been modified. Commit So it's a committed and see automatically a project started to build. This build is started. Let's check the console output. Let's do a testing. Success. Hope it is uh video helps. Thanks for watching.